Turn the dose knob until you see the correct number in the dosing window. It will be lined up with the dosing indicator, like this. If your dose is 10, line it up with the 10. If your dose is in between the numbers, like 9, line it up in between. Do not count the clicks to measure your dose. The clicking sound doesn't match up to the units. Always confirm that your dose in the, is in the dose window. If you accidentally turn the knob too far, say like that, it's okay. You can just turn it back to the dose that you need, and in this case, 10. If your dose is more that can be dialed, you must give yourself more than one injection. A new needle and the priming step has to be repeated for each injection. Your pen will not let you dial more than a number of doses left in the pen, so don't worry. If you need the second dose, you can inject what is left in your pen and then use a new one to give the rest of your dose. Or if you prefer, get a new pen and take your full dose from the new pen. You may see a little amount of insulin left in the pen that you won't be able to inject and this is normal.